at the doors, but I heard the doorbell go, which means there's a package here. And somebody waiting at the bottom of the stairs. Good morning. Hi. Aha. Review time. Okay, so you guys said that you wanted to see more review videos, that they really help you, so here we go. My power of race go! You didn't think it was just this that we were looking at though, did you? <laughs> no, there's quite a few releases that we're gonna be going through today. Hoodies, compression wear, t-shirts, Stringers and tanks, tracksuit bottoms, shorts, and the new blackout leggings. So before we start, let's cover the basics of me. I'm just over 5'8", so I'm between 5'8 and 5'9". I have a 42 inch chest, but I tend to wear a 42 to 44 inch size chest because of my shoulders. So what happens is when you've got bigger shoulders as well as a chest, these take up a lot of room in the upper levels of t-shirts. And what that does is it will raise the hem of a t-shirt. So I very often have to wear a large in t-shirts when the reality of my actual chest measurement would put me in a medium. In an elongated t-shirt, I can get away with mediums because it'll stretch around the shoulders. The hem will lift up, but because it's elongated, I don't end up with that kind of cropped t-shirt look. I tend to take a large because of this fact, so it's important to take that into account when you're buying these things. We're gonna be taking a look at one of each of the items for you for the sizing and fit, but obviously everything comes in a multiple array of different colors and schemes, so make sure to check those out on the website to find the ones that you'd like. So let's start with the new Pioneer tracksuit bottoms. These have been out a while and you will have seen us wearing these, but I don't think anyone's covered them in depth. So let's take a quick look. We've got embroidered Gymshark logo here, hidden zip pockets on both sides, active working drawstring with a fleece lining inside, a relatively low rise on here, so no drop crotch, no rear pockets. There's also an elasticated panel just here at the base, should you not have 12 year old girl ankles like me. But there is a secret zip just here in the legs for putting little secrets into. Working here a size medium, you can see it fits me very well with 30, 32 standard leg measurements. Next up in the tracksuits is the reactive training pants. So in comparison to the Pioneers, these are much thinner. So rocking these in a size medium, you can see that they're a very nice tapered cut. We've got that white panel detail into the inside, zip on the outer cuff, complete and utter stretch fit. So let's start with something that's already out and that's the Phantom Series t-shirts. These are one of the dry fit range and these are an evolution of all the dry fit that Gymshark has released in the past. Breathable, stretch, fabric at the top, right away across the chest, over the shoulders, which is an important area, and all the way across the back as well, giving you that breathability right the way across the top of the body. Now, because this is a stretch fit, like I said before, I can get away with my real measurement fitting. So I can get into a medium in these, absolutely no problem. Fits very, very comfortably around arms, chest and shoulders. Overprint Gymshark logo here, which is a stretch print, so I ain't gonna do no cracking. Breathable sections on the top of the chest and over the shoulders, and again, more stretch allowed in these areas around the traps, the shoulders and the chest, to allow you to get a more realistic fit. The problem with most t-shirts is they're not designed for people that lift, which means all these areas don't give in stretch, which is what raises the hem. Having these stretch panels at the top here means that the hem isn't affected by any range of motion that I can put in. You can see that's not lifting. Elongated fit that isn't compromised by a larger chest and shoulders. So here's a long sleeve version of the Phantom in a gorgeous light blue, and again, a size medium. A big, big step upgrade in this is, they've definitely allowed for a longer arm length on the smaller sizes. So if you guys are a little bit taller and normally think to a medium have to get larger to use the arm length, definitely on the Phantoms, you're gonna be able to get a much better size and fit due to that elongation. The body again, nice and elongated and giving a great overall fit. Damn, this color looks real good on me. Woo! And on the underside of the hem, it's upside down, but you can see it, the beer visionary. Next up, we have the Transcendent T-shirt. Now we're moving more into standardized fitments and t-shirts here. This does incorporate some dry technology into here with breathable areas, but it is not as stretchy as the previous things that we looked at. So these are wearing a size large. So 
So as it's not got those expandable panels up at the top, my shoulder's taking up much more room lifting up the hem. So going with the large lets me get that elongation in the body, but still a nice tapered and cut fit on the arms. And a notable 3D silicon printed logo here, which is pretty cool. Every time I take something off, this beard's gonna get wider and wider and wider. By the end of it, we'll be like, ah. Now on to the convert T. So here we have the Atlantic Blue in a size large. Again, this is a stretch fit, but not as with the seamless of the Phantom style. This is a much more tapered fit than the Transcendent that we just looked at. So much more form fitting. With some cool detailing just there. Boom. So out of the dry fit wearing into the more cotton stretch fit. So these are look, feeling much more like a soft cotton t-shirt. And these are the form fit version twos. This is a size large and a really beautiful tapered cut. Softer touch, a good stretch fit. We have a 3D silicon printed logo at the top. But simplicity is the key to this one. It's all about the fit and the feel. Hi. Standard brew to keep me going. It's snowing outside as I film this. That's our view this morning. A beautiful snowy day. Oh, onward. But if you do get up close to these, you can see there's some nice additional detailing giving a raglan sleeve stitch line as well as a standard. Treat these as a standard fit, but you've just got these additional nice details added in there. That's a large, offering that nice elongated body line. Arms on these are definitely shorter than on other versions, just to help show those arm gains. Woohoo! Back onto some classics, the Element Stringer. And there we go, simplicity again being key, keeping down those huge logos and branding, we just see the Gymshark logo on the back. A real nice deep cut, so we've got a racer back, we have the tapered straps over here, Again, rocking a large to allow for that body length. Stretch fit, but tapered. Panel detailing along the side, just to add some details for the eye that you can see up close. But again, they're just there for looks. Good, solid string fit. The Element also comes in a tank version with the logo on the front. This is an overprint, soft, not 3D. Has a nice same detailing down the sides, but obviously has a tank fit. So that means it has a higher neck. It has less of a drop around the underarm and doesn't have the razor back and just a more shallow Cut out. So for those of you who don't like showing any of the side of the chest or too much of the back, or just simply want to be a little bit warmer, the tanks do the job. Man, I am murdering this blue colour. Huh. Next up is the Element Sweatshorts. I'm going to take a look at them in this amazing Port Mile. Again, that nice shine to the material. That is a 3D silicon printed Gymshark logo. This incorporates more of their dry technology. So there you can see it's a real nice almost basketball style fit to them. These again are a medium and a really, really nice, comfortable, and more importantly, stretch fit. These are 100% some of my favorite shorts that Gymshark have released. They sit just above the knees, so they're nice and comfortable. You can do a multitude of training in them, but you can also wear them nice and casually for kicking around with high tops or anything like that. I just think they're honestly one of my favorite shorts that have been released. I have the two hidden zip pockets either side, no more days of sitting on the bench with your shorts on and your phone just sliding off and getting crushed behind you in the weights. And take a look at the Transcendent shorts. So you see these fit well above the knee. These have exact same material feel as the reactive training pants. Really stretchy, but really lightweight. We've got two pockets, they're not zip pockets. Tennis short pocket feel. Rocking them in a size medium. And last but not least, the brand new blackout leggings. So over the past year or so, leggings for men in training has become more and more popular. I personally love training in them. They help keep warmth in the joints. They give you that extra little bit of comfort whilst training. And I've got to be honest, I love the way these look. The detailing is done in like a dot work camo effect. These are listed as the black. I'm going to wear these in a medium. They're designed to be worn under shorts. But to be honest with you, if you're confident you don't mind strutting your stuff, rocking these just on their own wouldn't be a problem. And they are absolutely spot on fit. We've got elasticated waistband. We've got the stretch areas where it's important, that dot work camo detailing. And everybody who knows me knows I've got the ankles of a 12 year old girl. Ankle sagginess test. Nothing. Nothing. Check it out, there's a really cool Gymshark reflective logo down on the bottom of the ankle. I'm missing a bobble hat. There is a beanie being released as well. Where's my damn beanie? Right, come on.
You owe me a beanie. Yeah, the mannequins with no heads. <laughs> Okay, on the way in. <laughs> Hi. Hey, David, you Long time, high five. How are you? See you. I'm going to give you a cuddle. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Thank you. So there you go, final item that is going to be launched is the blacked out Jim Shark bobble hat. So there you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. So there you go, that is the end of this first review video that I've brought back at your request. Everything is going live today. By the time you watch this video, it will be up on the Gymshark website. It is gonna be the pre-release to the Black Friday. So this is the time to grab what you want because by the time Black Friday comes around, some of the stuff's probably are gonna be gone. Dan will in on the minor details. Dan Cam. So, any second now, our time, which has already happened your time, the blackout sale will be live. A lot of their products are gonna be on the website at a discounted rate all the way up until Black Friday. Go and check them out, because once they're gone, they're gone. And yeah, obviously Black Friday's coming when the whole website's going to be discounted, so enjoy. No punching, no scratching, no screaming. <laughs> enjoy the sales. And if you like the video, let me know. Hit that thumbs up and the like button. Use the link below to let us know where you're all from, so we can start creating some content around you guys specifically. Especially the UK audience as well, because we don't like to let you guys get forgotten amongst all those Americans, although we love you all equally. So until the next one, thank you all for tuning in. From me, Cranny, and the team. <laughs> that is all for this video. Enjoy. Professional. <laughs> 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 <laughs>